God bless everybody. This is Troy Alexander. Today is January 11th, 2018. I just want to come and share an encouraging word tonight as God was just encouraging my heart today. Coming from the book of Psalms, chapter 34. I'm going to read two verses, verse 4 and verse 6. And verse 4 says, I sought the Lord, David now, and he heard me and delivered me from all my fears. Then verse 6 says, this poor man cried, and the Lord heard him and saved him out of all of his trouble. And I, when I read that, David said, I sought the Lord and he heard me. That means David had to be making some kind of noise, some kind of movement, some kind of action for God to recognize that there was somebody that was seeking who he was. And then he went on to say, this poor man what? Cried, and the Lord heard him. And what? Saved him out of all of his trouble. If you got to cry sometime, go ahead and cry. Wipe your tears. Why? We've been may endure for a night, but what? Joy is coming in the morning. Whatever you got to do, make sure you seek him, God, for who he is. No matter what's going on, don't you let go of your, 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 your trust and your belief in who God is. I don't care what's going on. Know that God is able to do it, and there's nothing too hard for God. If you read the book of Matthew chapter 6, it talks about how God takes care of the birds of the air. It talks about how he takes care of the grass of the field and the lily of the field. How much more about us? God's not going to take care of the grass better than he can take care of us. God said there's no way he made us in his image and his likeness. He's not going to take care of something that's greater than what he made in his image. I need you to hold on to God tonight. I don't care what's going on. Keep giving God praise. Make your noise. Seek God. The Bible says that hunger and thirst after righteousness, what? Shall be filled. God said, they that seek me, what? Shall find me. They that knock, God said, the door shall be open. That's in Matthew chapter 7, verse 7. Hey, I just need you to know to keep on seeking God. God said, I'm here for you. God said, whatever you need, I'm there for you. If you need peace, I'm peace. You need joy, I'm joy. You need money, God said, I'm your money. Why? The earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. And they that what? Dwell therein. There is nothing too hard for God. God said, I will supply what? All your needs what? According to my riches and glory. God said, seek me. Matthew 6.33 Seek ye first the kingdom of God, his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. Your money shall be added. Your job shall be added. Your joy shall be Your happiness. God said, I'm turning your mourning into dancing. God said, that's what I'm going to do. Be encouraged tonight. Know that everything that you need is in God. And I just need you to seek him. Whatever's going on, I don't care what time it is. It might be midnight, almost midnight. But you keep on seeking God. Paul and Silas had a prayer meeting and a praise meeting in the prison. Yeah, in the dungeon. They had a praise and a prayer meeting. I don't care where you are right now. Keep on giving God praise. And tell God thank you for bringing you out and turning it around. Why? Because all things is working for your good. God bless you tonight. Be encouraged. The Bible said that David said he sought the Lord and, and God heard him. Delivered him out of all his fears. The poor man cried and God heard him and Saved him out of all of his trouble. Let God hear you tonight. Go before God right now. And don't stop going before God until you get what you need. Don't you let go. You tell God, I'm going to let go until you bless me. Until you turn it around, God. And hold on. Even when, even then, you hold on to God and let him go. God bless you tonight. Be encouraged. God loves you. And we do too in Jesus' name.